The men's soccer team took baby steps in each of its first two seasons in Canada West. Two wins, eight losses, and two draws in 2014 to three, six, and three last season. Head coach John Antilov says it's important to get in as many games as they can now before the first kick that counts. Well, because the season is starting so early this year, right, getting as many games as we can in early and getting the new players acclimatized to what we do and how we do it is, is key. And there are new players. Five quality players are gone from last year's team. Among them, keeper Travis Froelich, who was the go-to guy in goal the first two seasons in Canada West. We've had a lot of transition in the last, you know, this is third year now, and we had four new, another 14 new players coming into the program, along with all the new goalkeepers. Everything's up for grabs right now, and, and everybody's really come in pushing. The intensity in the training camp's been the best out of the three years we've had so far. The core of the returning players are mainly second and third year guys. With no fifth year players, there are three returning fourth years, including Williams Lake product Ryan Glanville. He was a Canada West All-Star a year ago in his first season with the Wolfpack, tying for third in Canada West goal scoring with eight. That's three more than the entire Wolfpack team scored in their first season in CIS two years ago. Much of the lead on the attack will fall on the shoulders of Glanville and speedy third-year forward Mitch Papadenitz. I think we do have a couple guys that are coming in in supporting roles as well that can add another element into the game. Um, I think a lot of... Uh, the play in the offensive half will kind of go through me and Mitch and um, but I mean it really will kind of you know hopefully we won't be able to get keyed in on and that's where some of these supporting guys can help kind of pick up the pace and you know the attacking mentality. We lost five key players um, but John's done a really good job recruiting and everything so we're uh, we're looking pretty good. Papa Dennett scored twice, including this winning goal in the second half of a 2-1 win over the Quest Kermodes from Squamish. The Wolfpack will play five games this weekend and more next weekend at the UBCO tournament, ahead of the start of the Canada West season in two weeks when they host UBC and Victoria. It's an earlier start by two weeks because of an expanded schedule to 16 games. So we get an extra four games out of it. And yeah, I love it. I love the fact that, you know, we get to, to play other teams. And our schedule got tougher because now we got University of Alberta and Calgary in, in our mix as well, too. And those are not going to be easy games. But, I mean, for us, it's, that's what we're here for and that's what we want to play. The rest of the Wolfpack weekend looks like this against UNBC tomorrow night at 6, Saturday at 1 p.m. against McEwen, Sunday versus Douglas also at 1 p.m. And then Monday morning at 10 o'clock against the University of Northern British Columbia.